Right, another uh, question that was uh, talked too much, I would say. So the strength of H2O2 solution can be expressed as the volume of O2 produced at STP. <coughs> so they have given an example. So a liter of 20 volume strength of H2O2 will give 20 liters of oxygen. So it says in a reaction like this, if you have 20 liters of oxygen that is given out, the volume of strength is 20. That is the idea. So for an example, if a reaction gives 10 liters of oxygen, the volume strength would be 10. Okay. So they assume this is non STP 22.4. You should know that a bottle uh, labeled X contain H2O2 solution. Okay. And they are going to uh, treat this KMNO4 in the presence of uh, acidic condition and uh, the endpoint was given and they are asking the volume of the solution. Okay. So let's go to the calculation first, right? So what it happens really, when you add uh, H2O2, you know, in the previous paper also, I told you this before, H2O2 in acidic condition is more likely we get oxidized, right? So meanwhile, KMNO4 get reduced. <coughs> So KMNO4 get reduced to MN2 plus, that is what I have written here. And H2O2, where this uh, oxygen here is in minus one, is going to be oxidized to zero. So this is the typical reaction. Then I uh, multiply this and I balance this one. So I see here two is to five ratio between MNO4 minus and H2O2. Uh, then uh, I have this number of moles of uh, KMNO4 that is used here and based on the number of moles I calculate the number of moles of H2O2 here so I divide by 2 multiplied by 5. So this is the amount of reacted H2O2. So the number of moles of oxygen that should be formed is very similar to the amount of H2O2 consumed. So this is 62.5 to the power minus 3 moles. Then uh, I know at STP for one mole, the molar volume is 22.4. So that the volume should be like 1.4 moles uh, that should be formed uh, for this uh, particular amount. Okay. Uh, if it is, uh, yeah, this calculation should be a little bit uh, different, I guess. So you know for one mole, uh, the volume is uh, 22.4. So we need to find the moles, number of moles is 62.5, the volume is V. Yeah, so it's similar. So this is 1.4. Actually, this should not be moles, it should be liters. So it should be 1.4 liters that of oxygen that is going to form. So please uh, check the calculate if the calculation is correct okay uh, so if this is 1.4 so this is 1.4 means the volume strength of the solution would be like 1.4 right but actually this is not the problem one thing is i don't see an, an, an answer for this one but the real reason behind this but i guess that the answer is given as all is I have taken this H2O2 oxidation as this one. This is the oxidation reaction for this particular mixture with MnO4 minus. However, they have given us this equation where two H2O2 molecules gives two water molecules and oxygen. Right? So this is confusing. That's the major issue here. Right? Because here oxygen is minus one. And here oxygen is zero. And here oxygen is minus two. Right? So this is now typically not a oxidation reaction this is now a disproportionation reaction where my oxygen is has gone from minus one to zero and minus one to minus two reduction oxidation so this 
becomes very difficult to calculate right because if it is disproportionating for our oxidation reaction right yes this h2o2 giving o2 is okay but for the redu reduction reaction considering the reduction here we should consider the reduction of mno4 minus to mn2 plus as well as h2o2 to h2o okay which becomes which makes our question even more difficult to calculate because we already don't know what is h2o2 because we are trying to get the amount of h2o2 reacted using the mno4 minus given <clears throat> But for MnO4 minus is a reduction reaction. For this particular reduction reaction, not only H2O2, but also MnO4 minus. Both are participating. So that is the difficulty. So the reaction that given makes this question even more difficult. And there is a problem here in this question. That is why they have given the answer as well. <coughs> okay so it is but however it is necessary that you need you understand this uh, calculation a little bit okay <clears throat> 